Okay, here we are with a DirecTV slimline dish. Somebody moved and they threw it away. And uh, even came with a second mount right on the same pole. I even left the cement that was on it on it. <laughs> and uh, this is just temporary. Uh, so I can uh, do this video on how to um, uh, modify these dishes so that uh, you can use them for uh, a free to air. Okay, what we're going to do is just remove the old cabling because uh, we're not going to uh, use the uh, existing electronics. So, uh, the next thing we'll do is uh, zero the angle on the dish. Okay. So now we rotate this to zero. Okay, I'm back. Went and got some tools. Okay, so what we need to do is get a magic a magic marker. Those are my neighbor's dogs. They're good watchdogs. Okay, we put a square on here. So it touches the center, bottom of the center feed horn, and uh, and we mark it over here. Okay, and that's our focal length point. Okay, so then, because we're not going to use this, this this feed horn assembly, so then we take and measure 18 and a half inches eighteen one half inches to the focal point on the dish Okay, <clears throat> this is the result of uh, tuning the dish. In the uh, post hole driller that we just got spotted, had to put a new carburetor on it. While uh, I get the camera going, we're going to go over and uh, drill a hole for another satellite dish. you make a hole the easy way. Okay, this this is a, a used pole that I got. Somebody had moved and dug it out and threw it away. It had all this had a big blob of cement on the bottom of it. I took the sledgehammer and broke it off. And a guy had put inside of it another piece of metal, part of a uh, bracket he screwed onto it, so it wouldn't turn when it's cement cured, and it, it got old. Uh, very good idea. Usually we put a, a bolt through there, or a, a big spike or something. This guy had extra ones of these, so he used them, I guess. So the hole drilled out, uh, and we're down two and a half feet. I'm going to align this. So this extra antenna bracket will be uh, north and south, so when I put another dish on here, it'll make it easier for me to orientate everything. So what I've got to do is uh, get a bag of cement, pour some cement in there, put some water in there, uh, and uh, put some dirt on it, make sure it's nice and straight. Leave it for a day or so, and then we'll be all set. 
So that's where we're at. Be back in a little bit. Okay. So now we put cement in the hole. And uh, we've got this thing just about perfectly level in two different directions. And uh, what we'll do now is add some water to it, let it sit, and uh, it'll start curing. And I'll put a little dirt over it to, so the grass will grow around it, and we'll be all done. Okay, we got the pole all installed, leveled in all directions, and we got the uh, little side arm, so it's uh, north-south, and uh, we're good to go. So tomorrow, we will uh, put a dish on it.